What's going on, everybody? What's good? What's good? What's good? We're back at it again, man. Haven't done these in a mile because uh, <clears throat> Rooster Teeth or somebody, I don't know who the fuck is being racist to content creators about rapping to death about the content. Except a, a select few, I guess. I don't know type beat. But uh, I couldn't pass this up. This is fucking Thor versus Vegeta. I can't pass this up. Battle of the gods. Battle of royalty. Battle of the princess. I can't pass this up. Now, hopefully, one way or the other, I could get this bitch on YouTube. If I can, Drake's. Just hit the like button off of that alone, my guys. <laughs> if I can't, I don't know. Who, I don't know who to blame. I don't know who to blame. Type beat. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but uh, yeah, we just got done with the uh, introductions. You know what I'm saying? Talking about Thor and Vegeta. <sighs> Fuck. I love both these characters, but I, I think I'm gonna go. I'm gonna lean towards my boy Vegeta. Type B. I'm gonna lean towards Vegeta. You know what I'm saying? That's my boy. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> but uh, yeah, we're about to get into this death battle. Who y'all got? Let me know in the comments down below. And uh, don't block this. We should see. Let's dive one in. B e t t e r h e l p dot com slash death battle. <sighs> All right, the combatants are set. We've run the data through all. We, we run the data. Let's go for death battle. Let's go. Send to Kaishi. Ooh. Of course. Why? Why are you doing it? He would. He will attack a nigga with this. No, he was, no, he was powered. Damn. Oh, there, mighty warrior. What business havest thou upon earth? Throw that hammer at me again. And ah, look at this. That's all, dude. Shoot <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's go. Shmi. Ooh, right in the sternum. We, we, we. Shmi, 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 shmi. Ooh. Thou fightst well for a mortal. Alas, you face a god. We. Ooh. Okay. Who's... Oh, you afraid to blue? Bitch. I'm a. You... I have evolved beyond gods. <laughs> hey, talk to your shit. Y'all don't know what to do from uh, DBA. Dragon Ball of Bridge. I forgot his name. You fucking right. Back to Skadoosh. Oh, he caught it. He absorbed it. Shmi. Oh shit. <laughs> you know he ain't worthy. You know he not worthy. <laughs> I wonder if Goku you worthy. Uh oh. Ultra ego. Dang you went to that shit fast. Ooh. We. Ooh. Such as yourself feel fear. Ooh. Smake sure you can Oh, I'm in the face. Damn. Right the sternum. Damn. Okay, Thor still got his uh his warrior's might shit. Yeah. That it? Yep. Uh oh. What we got? Ooh! Shmee! We got my boy scooping on the damn leak and shit. Fire no! Oh, that god. No pun intended. <laughs> no! He's doing god blast? Oh my god. Weave. We. Oh shit! Oh, I thought that was it before. Oh, he's doing it now. Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. You right though. No, Vegeta! Damn. Uh, 
Vegeta, my boy. My boy. Get it? Thor won because he's a natural blonde. Despite Vegeta's <laughs> immense power and tenacity, the God of Thunder had him outmatched in several key areas. First off, the big one, who was stronger. Despite being up against the God of Strength, Vegeta actually matched up pretty closely with Thor. Both could output power far in excess of destroying a single universe. Mm. It's always tough to get an exact number for Dragon Ball Super's most powerful characters, but we can combine the size of Universe 7 with multipliers from Vegeta's transformations to get a rough estimate. It's important to note that Ultra Ego's power boost has never been stated, but we do know that Super Saiyan Blue Goku and Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta were roughly even in power. When Goku applied a Kaioken times 20 boost to fight Jiren, Vegeta kept up after going blue evolved, implying mm -hmm. that both increases in power are roughly the same increase. Similarly, blue Vegeta matched base top, and needed blue evolved to keep up with top's god of destruction form, which is extremely similar to Ultra Ego in theme and purpose. Given this is the best current example of a measurable form akin to Ultra Ego, we can assume that Ultra Ego's boost in power, at least initially, could be extremely similar in terms of a percentage increase, making Ultra Ego's original state about 20 times more powerful than Blue Evolve. With that in mind, Vegeta at his peak could destroy a universe roughly 260,000 times over. And Thor was pretty... That's just stupid. You put it like that. That's just that's just stupid. <laughs> that's just fucking stupid. Yeah, but these, these niggas are powerful though, bro. Like, like these DBZ niggas still powerful. Like, in the manga still going on and shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to get this movie coming out soon. <sighs> like, yeah, these niggas really are powerful, bro. Like, like uh, that Hulk versus a uh, Broly uh death battle. You know what I mean? Go about that. Like, I got that on the channel. <laughs> Be close to that. Taking a look at the Marvel Universe's size, which has a radius of at least a trillion light years, as well as scaling to the World Breaker Hulk, Thor ended up only about 10 times stronger. Not terribly different, and it's definitely possible mm. Vegeta's power could increase during the fight to match it. But even if he was stronger, it wasn't the only thing that mattered. Ultra Ego's damage absorption could only do so much against an opponent like Thor. Vegeta may have trained as a warrior from birth, but Thor has been fighting for millennia against a much wider variety of foes. That is true. Adapted Vegeta fairly easily. And the fact that Thor was way faster gave him a lot of leeway to use that extra combat experience. Applying Vegeta's transformation multipliers to the shockwaves from Goku and Beerus' punches, Vegeta should be able to fight at nearly 300 quintillion times the speed of light. But scaling mm. to Ares moving within plank time? Thor would be over 70 quadrillion times faster. More than fast enough to <sighs> avoid Vegeta's key attacks, and even more importantly, absorb all of them with Mjolnir. This alone could shut down all of Vegeta's ranged attacks. Sure, Veggie could absorb it back with spirit vision, but he'd have to hit Thor first. And with that much of a speed difference, that's easier said than done. And since Thor can just will the energy out of somebody, he could just take it right back. And then some. Even without absorption, Vegeta's key reserves are not infinite, and many of his battles have ended with him at low energy. He was exhausted by the end of the Tournament of Power, which lasted about one hour in total. Meanwhile, Thor fought an army for Well, over he did some shit, you know what I'm saying, to push him to that. If not for the fact that Thor has resisted existence erasure before, including physically, spiritually, and temporally. Meanwhile, Vegeta had no way to match the God Blast, which could have killed friggin' Galactus. And that guy has threatened the infinite multiverse with destruction just as a side effect of his battle. That's a Phew. level of power beyond anything we've seen in Dragon Ball yet, let alone Vegeta. Vegeta <laughs> yeah. was never going to go down. Who knows? Because Dragon Ball is not ending no time soon. And devastating godly abilities Good shit, man. Much for the Prince of All Saiyan. I wish the fight would, would have been a little bit more, though. You know what I mean? Like, that's a little bit longer. Vegeta but, yeah. nearly won until Thor blew his mind. You might say that pun was a kind of terrible. Shut your ass up. You don't do puns. We've yeah. talked about this. Yeah. Aww, yeah. Right, Shut your man. ass up. Well... The winner is Thor. The God of Thunder. Now, who we got next? Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. We'll be jumping into the next matchup next week. But you I did. Wait. Did I watch this? Hey, yo. I don't think I watched this. I seen it. Like, I seen the thumbnail. I don't, wait. Hold up. 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 Both baby girls. Scarlet Witch. Versus that Tana baby girl, both baby girls. Speaking of Scarlet Witch, y'all, y'all. 
Go watch Doctor Strange. Go watch Doctor Strange. Type B. It's a good fucking movie. Is it better than Spider-Man? No. But it's a good fucking movie. You still enjoy it. It's not woke. But y'all think it is woke. It's not woke. Trust me. Trust. Go watch it. It's a good movie. But I did not see this. I don't think I seen this fight. I don't think I seen this. I might try to get that on the channel. I might. If it doesn't get blocked, I might try to get it on the channel. No cap. I don't think I seen that fight. I seen this. This, 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 this is on the channel. Seen this. Yo. You can always get more death battle right now by clicking one of those boxes right over there. Yo. And by downloading the battle. Did I skip music, this fight? I know I skipped that Tanjiro and thing. Demon Slayer versus JoJo. I don't think I give a fuck about that fight to keep it a stack. I know I skipped that one. I didn't think I skipped this. What do we got? Who's was worried of my time. Omni Man? Nigga. Nigga. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with Omni Man on that one. No cap. I think I might go with Omni Man. No shit. May 23rd. I think I'm gonna go Omni Man. I think I'm gonna go Omni Man on that one. When does uh season three of the boys come out? I think is it June? I think it's June, right? Yeah, I think it's June. I'm gonna get that like. I'm gonna get that like. Uh, I think it's June. Oh, okay. Who y'all got? Let me know in the comments down below, bro. Speaking of this shit, I'm glad the, the boys are gonna get this season three rightfully fucking so. Wait no season two for uh Invincible. I think I think they already said they green that thing season two and three for Invincible. Correct me if I'm wrong about that. Type B. I was hoping we could see that shit this year, season two. I don't, I don't think it's gonna come out season two for uh Invincible though. I don't think so. Anyway, but uh yeah, uh our boy didn't win. Type B. Cause I'm like okay, why the fuck? How the hell Hulk? I mean Broly be Hulk, but then Broly not Thor though. So that is true. <laughs> Broly is not Thor, and yeah, th like this is a lot of inconsistencies with uh, Dragon Ball. That's really the problem. Cause like they need to like really like come out and just state shit. You know what I mean? But granted, that arc is still going on with that Ultra Ego shit. So yeah, and things ain't gonna be done till like, probably the end of the year, probably too. So that's the thing. But we also got again, like I said, we also got Dragon Ball Superhero coming out next month. But it was supposed to come out last month. Don't know why. I guess. I guess since, since they got hacked, I guess. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. Hope y'all enjoyed this reaction, man. If you guys did, <laughs> if you guys came in, watch this fucking video. <laughs> I could be recording this video for no fucking reason. But, uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this reaction, make sure you a like, man. Comment down below, bro. Subscribe. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get that Zantana versus Scarlet Witch fight on the channel. Because I, I know I didn't watch this fucking fight. I've seen the thumbnail. I. It must have went, something must have came out or something, and it must have came, went smooth over my head, low key. That's what must have happened. But, uh, yeah, all you guys, I'll see y'all in the next one, man. Peace.